what's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Thanks for supporting me right here. I really appreciate it. We're going to break down uh, ACDC. You shook me all night long. We're going to go through the intro, all the parts, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. So let's zoom in and break it down. Here we go. All right, let's start with that intro. Middle finger on the third of the B, ring finger on the third of the high E. We're going to strum, starting with the D string. Strum the whole thing from the D string down. And to combine, to combine two different guitar parts into one, you can start doing a little dun 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 on the D string after that chord's ringing out. Pinky's going to grab the fifth fret of the high E. And you're still strumming it, so. So bam, 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 bam. And so that's where the index finger is going to grab the second fret of the high E. So check it out. So, yeah, I go to a D, and it looks like a it looks like a regular D chord, but the old middle finger is muting that high E, and then eventually that middle finger is going to come over and do a little pull down on this third fret of the D. So check it out from the intro from the top. So there's a little move that happens while you're holding this. It goes like this. So ring fingers on the third of the B, index is on the second of the G. You first, we did this. Then we're going to go. So my middle fingers on the third of the D, and then my pinky hammers to the fourth of the D while I'm holding this shape. So I do that, then it's the chord, then immediately pull off that third again. Right to this part again. So on that second time, it just rings out on that D power chord once again, which is a D chord with no high E in there. So one more time from the top of the intro, really slow. So now we go into the main riff, which is going to be a G power chord, which is a third fret high E, third fret B, third fret low E, and that middle finger is muting the A string. So you get these nice clean sounding chords with a bit of overdrive. We're going to also be cutting the chords off with our right hand. Next we're going to go to a C power chord, which is just like a regular old C chord, but that middle finger is muting the D string instead of pressing down on it. So we have G cut off, now some C's and G's, but power chords. C, C, G, C, 
G, and then, then a D. And you cut it off. So from the top of the main riff. C, C, G, C, G, D. Now we need some G's and D's back and forth. And so that's G, G, D, G, D, G. And that D chord has no high E in it. So from the top of the main riff. So what happens is before it goes to the chorus, it goes, it does one more time. Right here. Into the chorus. So uh And G. So here's an instance where we are kind of hearing the high E on the D chord. And just down, 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 down. Dum G, you know, G, G. Open A, so O, two, three, with middle finger, ring finger. And once I hit the ring finger there, I get into the C shape. But what I'm really wanting to do is just kind of emphasize that G string. But if you get the other strings in there, it's, it sounds good. So. So C. Then middle finger goes to second of the A while I'm holding that right there, you know, from the C chord. Then the D power chord. Then the O two three again. So only a couple other things. I mean, the solo, I'm going to dedicate. I'm still working on it, but I'm dedicating it to its own video. But so we've got uh, all the parts. The only thing that happens is before the guitar solo, which is just over the verse and chorus, but before it, it just builds on that D. And then also at the end of the song, it it just holds on that D chord. Oh, you shook me. 
long, long. So it's just holding on that D for the ending. So, uh, so that's the whole song. Uh, real quick, just back to the intro, just a r little refresh. Got the verse riffs. And the chorus. All right, guys, thanks again for the support. I really appreciate it. And uh, make sure you're following Marty Music. Um, we'll see you again real soon. Take care.